I want to try to grow a cucumber in a pot that is low maintenance. I generally don't like pots because you have to water them more and such, but I want it to be movable so that if the weather turns, I can bring them inside, so hand pollinate them and still let them continue to produce cucumbers. It's a pain, I've done it before, but with a compact variety, I think it might work. I was very surprised to see these replacement seeds come in. The note basically saying their product wasn't as it was advertised last year, so they're replacing it with a new one. Not that I would know because my cucumbers did not grow last year. They just didn't grow. And I don't even, I didn't remember that I bought territorial seed, but hey, let's plant them. Cucumbers usually germinate pretty quickly, and this says it only takes 45 to 50 days from germination to have cucumbers. So I'm really excited about these, and they're good for containers. This is a pretty large pot that I'm going to use. So I'm gonna stuff the bottom of it with grass. This will save some soil. Okay, that's a lot of grass, but I'll shove it now full of soil. I've never actually done this before. So I'm gonna do two pots. This one's pretty small and this one's pretty big. So I shoved it full of grass. Hopefully it still grows well. And I'm gonna fill it full. Now, if this were a hill, we would plant four to six per hill. We're gonna pretend it's a hill. Oh, seven, that's okay. Then I'm just gonna push them in a little bit. These should germinate pretty quickly. Ran out, so I had to go get more soil. Since this one's so much smaller, I think I'm just gonna put four in there. I really like these pots because they have a little pan down here to hold water. You don't have to water it as often and the plant's roots will go down towards the water. The one by the sage, check out the sage plant we have. It's gigantic. It's probably four feet across like that big last year when we planted it. I'm gonna put this one in front of the parsley that's going to seed and the artichoke, which has a cute little baby artichoke down in there. Also next to one of the cone flowers that I planted, they are just not doing well here at all. Here's another one, it looks a little better. But the slugs absolutely love them and I've been having a hard time keeping them safe. I'm gonna steal a cup of tomato cages from the tomatoes. Okay, those are just crazy big for those pots. Okay, it says they only get two to three feet tall, so that's a little overkill. I'm gonna have to go get some small ones. And this is day 67 of growing a different variety of edible seed every day for 100 days.